Margaret Pemberton. I'm a Washingtonian, and I'm a retired nurse. Well, you know, I, I worked right there at D.C. General for many years. You know that nurses are the saints of the world. So I had my lover died of AIDS, and it, oh. nurses would come in the middle of the night. I made, I slept, I stayed in the room with him because I would do all the work. And he would say, put her on the list too. I said, why? He said, because she ran her hand over my face and made oh, me feel like a human wow, being. That's wonderful. And I mean, it was five or six. And yeah. in that hospital, these saintly creatures called nursing, because you know, when you can't cure a disease, then it's a nurse's job. It's really the nurse who gives the warmth and the healing and the comfort and the love when all yes. hope is lost. And you know what I'd like to pass on to nurses and other people? that when you think it, the end is right there, if you would just put your head to the pe person's ear and say something very heartwarming and make them feel that there's somebody there with Yeah, them. I have a book. I want someone holding my hand. Yes. It's 30 Wishes book. It's funny, I finally wrote my will, but I've never, I've got 25 copies of the 30 Wishes, but I've never filled out one myself. <laughs> because it was hard for me to write a will. People die without wills. It's hard to sit down and say, what do I really want to get with what? And many times you write it early and you have to right. change it so many Oh, times. I did that with bank accounts. I found out that my bank account was in my, my one account. I, all my C, uh, uh, IRAs were in trust for my lover who died in 1990. I discovered that in 2007. Yes. He was dead 17 yes. years. Yes. Okay, listen, get in there. Don't take it. Thank you. Glad to Thank meet you. you. Thank you so much. Thank you.